Hello there guys, and welcome to this part 3 of the Let's Try of the Marlow Briggs and the Mascot Death. So in here, we're continuing from where we left, it's just... We finished last time in the cave, but... Quickly brought us here to this... Ventilation shaft, where we're throwing people into the fan. Here we go. The God of Human Sacrifice, eh? Ha <laughs> ha, get it? Get it? And this is uh, another one of those shooter sections. I never really showed I think any shooter sections apart apart from me shooting down helicopters. Now we're shooting helicopters again. This game really hates helicopters. I mean you destroy so many helicopters in this game, it's ridiculous. Yeah, shoot them all! Oh, look at that, those things blow up as well. Everything is blowing up here. It's a fat helicopter, so it must be a mini-boss or something. Oh yeah! Yeah, get everything blown up, look at that! Get the whole thing to blow up. It's way too much hazard here, I mean... Whoever is building this, I mean, clearly they had no sense of health and safety because... There's way too many explosive things here, way too many. If one thing goes off, everything goes off. Yeah, I'm not surprised that happened. Uh, it's like Death Eaters. Yeah, you can tell these kind of enemies are gonna get annoying. There's always, every game should have annoying enemies, you know. Can't get these guys, they keep disappearing. This is another crazy stuff. I mean, those rocks you see falling, they can actually hit you. So you have to keep dodging them whilst climbing extremely slowly. Ow. Now we fight these guys on top of some kind of island or something. This game takes crazy to a whole new level, seriously. In here, more platforming. Oh, that's crazy stuff. Come on. Ugh. It's cut right through us. Look at, look at this almost non-existent health there. Viciousness, eh? Juggernaut of Chaptan. Yeah! Whoa, careful with that thing. Whoa! Alright, mate. Gonna hit yourself at this rate. It's a little bit further into the fight. He lost his helmet, so gone a bit crazier if you see swinging that thing like like I don't know and then he gets tired and that's your chance yeah right in the nuts and instantly and the moment we uh, this game loves doing this doesn't it whenever you finish off a boss you get the chance to control them briefly fight minions why didn't these guys come out to help their own ally Whilst I was fighting him. This is a pretty cool section. Just dodging stuff. Oh god, what is that? What the hell? Yeah, boss fight! Fighting like a professional. <laughs> Those guys are just backing away. They're like, what the fuck? We didn't sign up for this shit. Oh, I was hoping I could throw one of them into the creature's mouth. That would be nice. Climbing a tentacle. Haven't seen crazier things yet. It's a pretty long climb, so best to skip it. Yeah, take this, bitch! Oh, that's gonna leave a mark. 
It escaped. Bunch of riot cops. Their shields. Mr. Briggs. Mr. Briggs. That Chinese guy, he's gonna get what's coming to him, seriously. He keeps taunting you repeatedly. He keeps saying stuff on the radio. Yes, we do understand each other. I'm gonna tell your head off, mate. What the f... What the, why did he just fly into the air like that? Oh my god... And this... Uh, a fair bit forward now. Been doing the snowy section. Not my favorite, exactly. There's quite a lot of those undead wraths, those undead priests or whatever they are. So many of them. This is a slightly different one. It's like a female one or something. And I've been doing this some crazy puzzles here as well. Yeah, nothing much to see here. And sliding section. Oh well, it's the same. It's a pretty long section, look at that, it's already going up, taking us into the jungles. Yay! There's some kind of chaos going on here, there's two of those giants. Plus loads of smaller enemies. And then there's this. This thing just... Just killing everything. Holy shit. Oh, <laughs> I thought I'd beheaded him back there. That ought to leave a mark behind. Let's lure them here. Alright. Now we're just gonna bash the other one. <laughs> the fuck was that? He just went like constipated. My constipation sets in. It's a big problem. Alright, new weapon! So it's like a giant hammer. And another one of those still motion cutscenes. Oh gosh. Let's try this weapon out then. I've upgraded it and all. Damn, it's slow. I think I shattered the guy's kneecap. It feels quite heavy. Seriously, it's, it, it takes me as long to swing that as it takes that guy to swing his thing. So I decided to... Decided to change it. It's a lot easier with the daggers. Oh well. Oh my goodness. Zipakna. What the hell is Zipakna? It's a big... Bad boss. Oh yes, that's another ability that I got during the Snowlands. Ability to freeze enemies. And seems to be working even on, on the bosses, which is nice. Let's try this weapon again. Let's give it another chance. What the hell? It's got no range. Ah. Oh. Look at it! It's got a crappy range. And it's slow. This is the worst weapon ever. There's no way I'm gonna use that. Let's take my chances with the whip and with the daggers. The whip has a range. And the daggers, they're pretty good against one-on-one -on -one fights. Because you get up close and personal. And they're pretty fast, so you always get enough chance to recover. It's pretty easy boss otherwise. I mean, they probably were expecting for you to use that new weapon that you get. 
Oh, that was nice. Did quite a bit of damage, except he hit me as well. That's alright. Yeah, he will go down eventually. Okay. So, I guess we get to control him as well. Of course we do. Quick attack, strong attack. Come on, let's get these guys. And then we're gonna finish the episode. Oh yes, that felt good. One slap, killed him. Are they just standing there? Oh yes. And committed suicide. Alright. I guess we'll continue the next episode.